7 for Rushworth as Durham edge first day. Derbyshire and Durham are separated by just 13 points in the middle of the pack in Division 2. The hosts' form has dipped slightly as Lees, Potts and England captain Ben Stokes made their mark in the Test Arena. The pair have won just three games between them, could either chalk up another over the next four days. Derbyshire would have to do so without Sean Massoud, an indelible mark already made by the Pakistani opener. Reese would deputise, opening alongside Godelman, but they were big shoes to fill and his innings was curtailed, trapped in front by Rushworth for five. Godelman was hot on his heels, a great diving catch from 19-year-old debutant keeper Tom McIntosh to hold on to the chance for Rushworth's second. Rain got in on the act, Madsen out well taken by Borthwick in the slips for ten. Deploy joined Guest and stopped the rot. Taking the score past 50 together, they were trying to mount the fight back Derbyshire needed and did so effectively. They made it all the way through to lunch, the score looking much healthier at 83 for three. But Rushworth stopped them in their tracks after the break, a third for the Durham Seamer, Guest bowled for 26. Swiftly followed by Cartwright, Stump sent flying as he was bowled for a first baller. Deploy and Dahl stuck together, Durham's charge halted for the time being as they picked up the pieces, moved past 100 and forged a resistant partnership. Deploy went to 50 off 96 balls, a single all he needed, his innings a patient one thus far. Suddenly the hosts looked bereft of ideas and they were struggling to carve out wicket-taking chances. Derbyshire took advantage, breezing past 150. Dahl joined Duploy up to his half century off 79 balls as he guided Rushworth to the third man boundary. They were up to 180 for five when T was taken, a good response from Derbyshire after a wobbly start to the session. The evening session arrived and Durham still struggled to make inroads, style the man to bring up the 200 as they scampered three off McAllendon. A Dahl single off Travaskis took them to a 150 run stand, but the focus was soon on the other end. Deploy waited, Travaskis missed his length, and with four slapped through the offside, he moved to 100 off 196 balls. Dahl was looking to follow his colleague to three figures, but wouldn't make it. Rushworth found the edge, McIntosh took the catch, and a 166 run partnership was over. Five wickets for the experienced Durham Seamer, who made it two in two. Thompson out the same way as Dahl before him. Durham sparking back into life in the final hour. There would be no hat trick for Rushworth, but he would pick up a seventh. Aitchison bowled for seven to leave Derbyshire down to their final two wickets, still 31 shy of 300. Stanley McAllendon had a wicket on debut. Sam Connors looked to lead, but the 18-year-old's delivery was on the money. Off stump rocks, Derbyshire now nine down. And McAllendon wrapped it up. Petman caught by Beddingham for a first ball duck. Derbyshire all out for 283. It wasn't really the total deploy's excellent unbeaten knock of 122 deserved, but outside of Dahl's 90, Guest's 26 and Madsen's 10, every other batter had fallen for single-digit returns after another vintage display with the ball from Chris Rushworth. He'll hope to have his feet up for all of day two as the batters return to the Sayat Unique Riverside, resuming their innings on two for none.